Hello Fox, welcome back to some more EA Sports PGA Tour. Now we're going to be jumping in trying the brand new course, Oak Hill. So let's just jump in there and get it started now. I do have the, the new camera mode on for the the button. Well, I've, what I should say is I've actually turned the green grids off, so we're going to be actually using the new camera mode. And let's see how it works. Now, I've never really been into the um, the true sim mode, so this should be quite interesting. <laughs> now, from the east course at oh, I put the commentary on just to hear this. New York. This is PGA Tour Golf on EA Sports. Alongside Frank Navalo, I'm Rich Lerner, and partner, you and I have called a lot of rounds of golf through the years. I know there's always something that piques your interest. How about today? Rich, every day brings you a chance, a chance to do something special. And, and when we get to sit in this perch, that's what I look for. And I don't want to see the, the head going down. I want to see that every single shot is a chance to do something special. That could be a chip. Maybe the chip goes in. Maybe it's a 30-footer that goes in. Maybe a drive gets rifled down the fairway. Do something special. Ah, okay. I thought they were going to go on a little bit more about the course, but... The didn't see me do that so what i'm going to do i'm going to jump out and turn the commentary back off uh, while we play uh audio there we go yeah i was kind of hoping they were going to give you a little bit more to that to be honest uh commentary commentary there we go down now now i did actually want to play this in my proper pga to a career mode but they haven't switched the courses round uh it's still southern hills for the pga championship this week but what I did is I, I sort of created a brand new golfer just to see if you've not got your PJ career mode actually running, um, Oak Hill will be actually in the career mode for this week's um, PGA Tour. But if your career mode is already uh, running, you can't, uh, they haven't actually switched the course around, so that was a bit of a bummer. Uh, what I was thinking of doing, I was actually going to like um, reset my career mode and start from the beginning again and go all the way through it until I got to Oak Hill. But there doesn't seem to be an option to change the, uh, to reset your, your career mode either, so that's a bit of a bit of a let down there as well. So let's get this started, shall we? I've got my, my new clubs, my Masters clubs on as well. we'll give them a little try. Now, I haven't tried this camera mode yet, so this should be blooming interesting. <laughs> right, let's get started. Um, here we go. I see I've still got the power bar turned off on the swing. We're still on the hardest swing difficulty as well. Now, I haven't actually turned off my putting meter. Uh, baby steps, baby steps. As I said, I'm not, I haven't really dabbled much into the sort of tour sim type of thing, but I just wanted to give this a try just to see what it's, oh, where's that going? Just to see what it was like. All right, well, we've got 124, 127. I'm going to go in there with the, yep, let's try that. Oh, 2.9% underswing. I don't even know if that's going to go on. Oh, it might bounce forward, actually. Oh, just on the, the first cut there. So it's going to be a little chip shot. Right. Oh, we got it. Good birdie. Nice one. <laughs> yeah, so that was a, a little bit annoying. I wanted to actually play it in my proper PGA Tour career mode. I mean, what I could have done is actually just skip through all the events and started the career mode um, from the beginning again. But that's, that's a lot of work just to play the course in the, the career mode properly. So we're just going to have to play it this way. Okay, what we've got here? Second hose, 403 yards. Par four. It's a nice looking course, this player, to be honest. Oh, that's a bit better. Only 0.4% slow and a little bit of an overswing. A little bit of run on the ball as well, not too bad. Let's see how my old eyes um, <clears throat> sort of live up to no putting grids. So this actually should be pretty fun, I reckon. I'm going to have to try and get the ball close to the bloody hole, though. <laughs> 
Now that looks like there's a little bit of left to right there, just by the way the ball sort of came down, so we shall see. Okay, let's have a look. How do I get it? Um, where? How do I get it to... Ah, there we go. Push down on... I had to push down on the right stick there for some reason. I thought you just hit Y. Oh, there's a little divot mark there. See it? It hasn't, hasn't repaired his divot mark. Right, let's have a look. Yeah, definitely some left to right there. See, this is the reason, one of the reasons why I, I never played sort of sim mode when I'm doing videos, because the, the videos would take too long by just kind of going through all this, this looking at the the green and stuff. So we've got, is that 17 feet, 7 inches up? Well, let's put it to about, see, there, maybe? Oh, that was straight. <laughs> oh, this is definitely going to be fun. Oh, my goodness. And when the ball came back there, it looked like it sort of turned a little bit. It looked like there was a little bit of a left to right slope on it there. But, oh, hey-ho. We'll get there. It'll probably take me a few rounds to try and get used to it. Because, as I said, I've never really sort of dabbled in the, the sort of no green grids and sort of two sim mode. Okay, what we've got here, third hole is 227, six hybrid. Um, I might just go with a five iron, you know. Maybe try and bring it in a little bit. Let's try that. Well, that's looking pretty good. If it gets up there. Oh, damn it. That was looking to be online there. We'll go with a little pick shot here. Now this is a camera mode I would have liked to have seen. I'd like to, to sort of come up so you can see the green a little bit more. Right, what have we got here? 12 yards, 8 feet up. Yeah, should be okay just hitting that from there. Oh shit. Sugar. <laughs> it's on the first car again. Alright, let's see if we can get another little chip in here. Oh, we got it. Nice save. Nice pass save, that one. Okay, full forwards, par 5, 615 yards. Looks like a little bit of downhill here off the tee. Okay, 23 feet down. Now, can we kind of cut this a little bit? How close are them trees? Oh, I don't know. Let's put a little bit of fade on it, shall we? We'll bring in a little bit from left to right here. That's looking not too... Oh, I was going to say that's looking not too bad. That might actually run into the first cut. And it has. We still, hopefully, might reach the green here. We're only in the first cut, so it shouldn't take... Oh, them trees are coming into play. It shouldn't take too much off the ball. But at least we're going to have to play this with a little bit of draw on it. Hopefully. It turns pretty well here. Come on. Let's hit a nice one. Oh my goodness, that's a massive slow, and it hit the bloody branch, didn't it? Yep, look at that. Damn it. Okay, bunk shot. Okay, what have we got? 38 yards, 5 feet up. I think we'll go with a little pick shot. I prefer the pick shots, to be honest, than the blasts. Let's put a little bit of um, a little bit of loft on that as well. 91 to 98 percent should be good from there, I reckon. Oh, that's not too bad. All right, let's. All ah, right, so I didn't have to press down on the right stick there. I just pressed Y. So I wonder if the first time using it, you have to press down on the the right stick. That's weird. Looks like it might be a little bit left to right there on it. Okay, another birdie that. I think it's the longer putts that are going to give me a little bit of trouble. Okay, what's this? Fourth hole? Fifth hole? 
And we've got another par 3, 183 yards. Okay, 183, three feet up. Let's bring that down to the eight iron, I reckon. Put a bit of loft on it. Because we've got that wind. That wind's going to help us there just a little bit as well. Well, I'll tell you what, they've added a lot of new stuff to the store as well. A lot of Adidas stuff, Foot Joy. Some nice looking stuff there. Some more Under Armour stuff there as well. They've added tons of Adidas stuff. Right, let's have a look here. Now, that definitely looks left to right to me. Two inches down. Let's try about there. Oh, it was a little bit left to right, but not as much as I thought. So it's definitely going to make the game a hell of a lot harder playing this way. But as I said, it might just make the videos that little bit longer. And I think for an 18 hole video, 30, 35, 30 minutes is, is quite long for somebody to watch, if you know what I mean. And then if you're adding this to it, you're, I'm talking 35, 40 minutes per video. It is a lot for somebody to sit and watch. I mean, when I watch other people playing, I, I kind of skip holes and stuff like that. So I, I see where a lot of people come from. I just think 30, 35 minute videos are just a little bit too long for people to watch. Right, let's just smash one right down the middle here. What is this? It's a par... It's a par 4, 486. We've got that water all the way down the right hand side there. Right, come on. That's a nice straight one. Not too bad. All right, we've got 189. Do apologize for hearing noise in the background. I think my, my daughter's in a bedroom. All right, let's just put a bit of loft on that. Oh, that's not too bad, actually. Oh, that's going to be not bad at all. 15 feet from the hole. Okay, six inches down. Let's have a look. Well, that looks pretty straight. Maybe a little left to right in it. I think. Oh, I don't know. Oh, just missed that one. So we'll pick up the pile there. We're still on minus two, which isn't too bad, to be honest. I thought I'd be all over the bloody place. <laughs> okay, seven tours, par four, 460 yards. With that little brook just coming in front of the, the green there. Okay, how far are we going to be able to drive this? Oh, the driver might actually run out here, I reckon. Let's pull the driver. Oh, tell you what, let's pull it back just a little touch there. Okay, we got the perfect on that one. A little bit of an overswing. Yeah, that should be fine. I don't think it's going to run that far down there. I'll tell you what, I'm actually surprised they brought this course out for free. You know what EA are like. You know, I thought they'd actually charge you five bucks or five quid or something for it. Because <laughs> EA are so bloody greedy. Right, what have we got? Um, let's put it on to finesse. A little bit of high loft there. We've got that three mile an hour wind as well. That should be okay, I reckon. Bit of an underswing, but it should be pretty up close to the flag there. Up to the hole. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Alright, let's have a look. What do you reckon? Bloody difficult, you know. To see. Go. <laughs> so that was a little bit of right to left on that. As I said, I think a few rounds doing this, I'll probably pick it up a little bit quicker, a little bit more. Or should I say a little bit better. 
Okay, eighth hole, par four, 430 yards. Beautiful course, though. I do like this. I must admit, you got to admit that the courses in this game look absolutely fantastic. Do you know what I don't like? I was actually on a two bloody door in the room. Um, 2K23 earlier on, and the club sounds, I've noticed a hell of a lot with the club sounds. I was, as I said, I was on 2K23 and I was taking some nice, hitting some nice shots, and I was like, oh, that sounds nice. But I think we can want in this game, and the I'm going to be frank here, the club sounds are absolutely horrific in this game. They're so generic, they're just like, they sound like golf games from like 10, 15 years ago. They're absolutely horrendous, the club sounds on this game. Right, what have we got? 116, 8 feet up. So that's playing, no, 108, should I say, in 8 feet. I keep looking at that bottom marker instead of the top marker. 108, so it's playing around about, what, 111. We've got 116. Let's put a little bit of loft on that there. Oh, that should be pretty good, you know. Oh, oh, oh crap. Too much loft, a little bit of spin. And it come off the back of the green, on, off the front of the green there. That would have been nice if I never put loft on that. Right. Um, let's go another little chip shot here. Right, that looked like it's got a little bit of a left to right. That's the thing as well now, I'm going to have to pay more attention to how the ball kind of rolls coming into the green. It'll give you that little bit of a little bit of a heads up of which way that the, the ball's going to roll when you're actually putting. Okay, ninth hole, par 4, 480 yards. Okay, let's just smash one right down the middle here, come on. Oh, and I know there's something as well they've got in the store now. They've got different swings. So I'm wondering, I might actually buy one just to see if it speeds up the back swing a little bit. They've got three or four, I think there was. Got an out-to-in swing. Um, oh, I can't remember the, the other names of the swings that they've got, but I might actually buy one just to see if it speeds up the back swing a little bit because I still think the back swing is way too slow in this game. Right, what we've got here? Um, 172, 21 feet up. That's playing what 179. Let's go up a club. Put it on finesse. 179. Let's put it up to about. Yeah, let's put it up to. Well, mind you, we're going in with a seven iron, so we might get a little bit of run on the ball here. One point two percent overswing. Well, I tell you what, that is going to be not bad at all. Only five feet from the hole. That definitely looks maybe a little left to right to me there. It was just a little touch. We sort of guessed that one right. It's actually it's, it's quite hard on a sort of two D flat screen trying to pick up the little undulations on the green. It would help with a little bit more shade, and I think. Right, what well, we've got? 10th hole is par 4, 439. Uh, we should be good. That shouldn't run out down at the bottom there. So what do you think of my new clubs? My master's clubs. Pretty cool. Or should I say, yeah, the full set. If you watch the, um, the patch notes video, I opened up the pack and got them. I didn't think, I thought it was um, depending where you came on the leaderboard, you were only maybe going to get the irons, or you're going to get the wedge set, or you're going to get the hybrid, or the driver, or the, the, the fairway wood, but I didn't think I'd actually get the full set, so that's pretty cool. Right, well, we've got 113, five feet up. Let's just try that there. That should be good. Oh, that should be pretty close. Come on. Oh, I might spin back a bit. Oh, it has. And you see it just moved that little bit left to right there. So I'm thinking we've got a little left to right putt here. I don't think it's much though. Don't think it's much at all. Pretty level. Let's 
Oh, oh, we got the lip out. Damn it. They, they ch sort of changed the physics on the cup as well. They've got to get more lip outs as well now. So we just missed that one. It was slight left to right there, but not as much as I thought. Okay, par three is hole 11, 245 yards. That pin looks pretty hard there. It's right at the front of the front left of the green here. What are we going in there with a five wood? No, that's not going to work. Six hybrid. Five iron. Oh, look at the, the flutter buys. It's my missus calls them. <laughs> right. Um, oh, I don't know. I think we might just have to go for the heart of the green here. Maybe bring it in that way a little bit. Let's try that. Oh, that stayed bloody straight. Don't go on the green, because that's that putt is going to be absolutely massive if that went on the green. We'll just take a little pit shot, hopefully get it up close to the pin. Okay, that should be okay. Oh, you son of a... Hit the pin and bounce back. Okay, we need to get this one for the par, though. This looks oh, quite a right to left putt to me here. It's level, so let's try about there. Turn your son of a... Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. <laughs> oh. Yes, so it's definitely up the difficulty of the game, which was one of my biggest complaints, actually. I thought the game was just way too bloody easy. But again, as I said, it's quite hard to sort of pick it up. I think the more you play it, the, the more we get used to it as well. Especially with um, how much the, the ball is going to break and stuff like that. Okay. You hear, see what I mean by the sounds? The, the, the club sounds are just ugh, they're horrid. I mean, for the game that looks this great, the presentation, the commentary and everything looks fantastic. And they, they just dropped the ball on the club sounds. They really have. Okay, what we got? 84, 8 feet up. So that is play, what, 90? So I think we're going to go up a club. Put it on a finesse. What did I say, 90? Let's put a bit of... don't want too much loft on it. I don't want too much spin. Let's try that. Run about there. Oh, that's looking not bad. Is it going to spin back? Oh! See, that looks kind of straight to me. It didn't sort of move off its line. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, it looks pretty straight, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm asking you as you just can't answer. Yes, there we go. Got another birdie that takes us back to minus three. Okay, we've got 13th hole, par five, 595 yards. We've got that brook just going right through the center there. Oh, I think. Oh, ho, ho, ho. we should be able to go over the top of that, I reckon. Downhill, definitely. Let's smash it. Oh, bloody hell, look how far that went to the right. I still think there's a lot of... I still think there's some randomness, randomness in this, you know. Because I could hit three of them shots. Two of them will go straight, and one of them will go the way that did. Um. Oh, now this bloody tree is well in my way. So I might have to punch this through here. Or maybe let's try a knockdown shot with a three wood, shall we? See how that works. Let's put it about there. Oh, that's not bad at all. That's actually going to go up onto the green. Oh, is it going to slow down enough, though? No, nope, that's going to go off the back, I think. Or is it? Oh, it's held. Oh, ho, ho. oh, this is going to be tough. 
Look at the length of this bloody putt. I can tell just by looking at that, it's definitely right to left. But how much? Oh, that looks... Oh, bloody hell. That looks quite a lot. Get down. Come on. Down you go. There we go. That looks quite a big break right to left here. Thinking run about here. Well, we've got 12 inches down, 43, so let's put that... Let's put it about there, shall we? Ooh, that looks too much there, but when you're down on that sort of little worm cam, it looks kind of that size of a break. That's not bad. That's not bad. I read that pretty well, I think. Um, maybe a little. Not too much. Oh shit! Uh, sugar. <laughs> you twat. Can't believe I frit. Oh, can't believe I screwed that up. Is that a double? Oh no, it was a par. Thank goodness for that. It was a par five. Bloody hell, we got away with that. Okay, 14th hole, par four. I think, was that par four or was that par three? It's a par four. Uh, 306. Oh, 306. I don't think there's any point going for the green that. So I think we'll just go up here with the three wood. And we'll just... um. Little pitch up on the green. That'll do lovely. Oh, it's quite a slope there. I should have I should have looked at that a bit closer. I would have liked to have been up on that flat part there. Come on, Bolt, hurry up. Right. So we've got 53, 15 feet up, so it's playing around about 58. Um put it up another club. Let's put a little tiny bit of loft on it, not too much. Yeah, let's try that, shall we? Oh, it stayed up there. A um, little bit right to left, I think. Okay, 20 feet's one feet down. Um, one foot's 12 inches, so what do you reckon? About here? Let's try that. Oh, a little bit more of a break than thought. As, I said, as I've said a couple of times, I think, after a few rounds of this, I'll, I'll probably get a little bit better at it. Practice makes perfect. But I think I'm doing not too bad. Minus three with the new putt and camera. We haven't missed many. Too bad. Okay, par three, 160 yards, hole 15. Pin is right at the back left here. Right, uh, let's bring it in just a little tiny touch from the, the right hand side here, six feet down. Uh, let's put on a finesse, a little bit of loft, and let's bring this back just a touch. I actually went left to right more than right to left. <laughs> but that's not a bad shot. Let's have a look. Ooh, what do you reckon? What do you reckon? I think right to left here. Don't think it's much. Son of a... It was a little bit right at the cup there, but not between me and the cup. So that was kind of a straight one. I think I, I'm trying, I, I may be overthinking, especially on some of the putts, thinking there's got to be a break there when there's not. Okay, 16th hole, par 4, 460 yards. Gives you a lot more to think about though, I suppose. I'm quite enjoying it. We'll see how long the video goes for. What we're we on at the moment? We're on 29 minutes, so that's not too bad. It's one of the reasons, like I said earlier as well, is I never really did it in 2K or TGC or whatever you want to call it. It's cause the, the times that I did try it, I was looking at the green way too long 
from different angles, from the behind the pin, from front of the pin, from the sides, turning the, the camera around. And I, I just thought that the videos were waiting too, way too long, but if I can speed the process up a little bit, then I'll probably play like this all the time, to be honest, because I think I'm quite enjoying it. Go on, get up there. Yes, get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh, you son of a... <laughs> Right, let's see if we can get a little chip in here. Oh, a little bit more, and I would have had that. So we've got a little tap in. This is, right, watch this, right? This is something that they need to fix. Watch this. Look. <laughs> I've noticed that a couple of times. If you yeah, if you've got a little tap and you do it quick, you don't actually get the button animation. So that, 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 they, they need to sort that out. It just looks a little bit dodgy. Okay, we've got here seventeenth hole, four hundred and that's seventy nine yards. Par four, up and over the crest here. Come on, nice. Oh, nearly got a birdie there, did you see it? Flying past. Looked like a pigeon. Oh, crap. In the heavy rough. We've got 87 to 96%. Oh, look at that pin position as well. Damn it. Uh, so we're going to have to go up a club here. Put, put a bit of loft on it. Not a lot there, to be honest. 84, 94%. I'm going to have to try that there. Let's go. A uh, little bit over. We're better there than back in the, the heavy rough though, I think. Oh, that's definitely a right to left. I can tell just by looking at it. Look at that. I don't think it's much again. But is it right to left though? Whoa. Right, don't overthink this. Come on. Ten inches down. So let's play it to about here. Start turning. Come on. Nope, oh, that was pretty bloody straight. <laughs> and that was me saying don't overthink these as well. Not every green's got a massive break on it. Okay, 18th hole, par four, 490 yards. Yeah, I'm pretty impressed with the course. Beautiful course. Very nice. But again, a little bit peed off that I couldn't actually, they didn't switch it around in the, the, the career mode if your, your career mode's already um, going. Right, let's smash one. Final drive of the round. That'll do lovely. So it looks like uh, the video I'm going to have to do for this week's PGA Tour is going to be at Southern Hills and not Oak Hills, the, the original course that they have in there. And I'll get that done over the next couple of days. Right, get back there. There we go. What have we got? 164, 5 feet up. 168. Let's bring that back. No, nope, can't, so let's put a bit of finesse on it. Let's try about there. Oh, wind's going the other direction. Oh, we we'll get the perfect 0.3% over. So that's going to be pretty good, I think. Is it going to come back for me? No, it stayed there. I still don't think you get enough spin on these balls um, coming into the greens. Um, all right, come on. Don't overthink this one. This looks pretty level, to be honest. Maybe a little bit left to right. So we've got, that's another foot down, so 20 feet. Let's play it to about, oh, play it to about here, maybe. Oh, that looks left, more left to right where I'm actually standing, to be honest. Oh, 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 damn it. It was actually right to left down by the cup. The cup. <laughs> so here we go. 
pop for the paw. So we'll end up there. Minus three, only one, I think it was only one bogey there. That wasn't too bad. We did get one chip in on the first hole. So that's three birdies, one chip in, one bogey. That's not bad for my first time using that, what you'd want to call sort of worm cam. I like it. Yeah, I do like it. And the video was 35 minutes, so that's not too bad, actually. I think we'll probably play that way from now on. Okay, guys, so there you go. That's a brand new course in EA Sports PGA Tour of Oak Hill in Rochester, New York. Hope you enjoyed that. Don't forget, guys, I will catch you again next time. Don't forget, stay safe.